Hello everybody, my name is Ian Lamont, and today I'm gonna to be talking about how to add a logo to your Shopify store. This is my Shopify store. I sell a bunch of different products, and uh, the store is called Easy Genie. That's the name of the store. This is, a, this is just text that I entered into the Shopify interface to uh, name my store. What if I wanted to add a logo? And actually, I have a logo prepared. Here it is. I wanna add this logo to my Shopify store. I wanna make it a lot smaller, so maybe no bigger than that, but I wanna put that at the top of the store instead of just this plain, ugly text. And here's how to do it. Go to your Shopify interface. Uh, you'll see something like this. Um, if you don't see this, actually, let's go to the home. When you come to Shopify, you might see something like this. It shows uh, data about sales and whatnot. You wanna click on online store, and then select themes if it's not selected already. So this is the live theme that I have. Click customize. And by the way, depending on the theme that you're using, there might be a slightly different way that you, that you add a logo, or uh, maybe there's some restrictions on how you can use logos. But what I wanna do is I wanna click on header. So basically header is everything up here. I wanna change the logo, so click and basically at the very top, if you click on header, um, you can customize different parts of your header. Logo is right at the top, 450 by 200 PX recommended. So what they're saying is they want an image that's not too big, 450 pixels by 200 pixels, 450 pixels wide by 200, 200 pixels um, tall, that's recommended. You can try to use other sizes, but First of all, it might make it a lot smaller than you're, than you're expecting. And also, maybe depending on how you set up your logo, it might push down the other stuff. Uh, so you have to kind of consider the positioning of different things and how you want your logo to look. Uh, but basically, this is a good guideline. All you need to do is select the image. Okay. Now, I actually have a couple logos uploaded already. If I, wanted to, if I wanted to upload a new one, I just click on upload and search for it on my hard drive, whether you're using a desktop Windows machine or Mac. So I am going to, let's take a look at this one. All right, so when you select it, it automatically pre-fills it into, the, um, in, into, the, into your website. So let's just click select. Okay. Um, if you wanna edit it, you can do some editing to it. So maybe alt text, that's for people who maybe need some help reading the screen. I can call it Easy Genie Logo. Hit save. And then hit save up here, in the upper right corner. Change is saved. So let's take a look and see what that looks like on the live website. Here's the old version, just a text, ugly text one. Just reload that page. And there's my logo. And if I want to, I can go back and do things like, um, I can left align the logo. If I want it to look like that, click save. But basically by messing around in the settings, you can make some adjustments and get a logo that you're happy with. For more information on how to get the most out of your Shopify site, go to leanmedia.org. That's my website. Check out the blog or the video. My name is Ian Lamont. Thank you so much for watching.